Good morning, good people. I'm John Cousins. I am stationed in Lawrence, Kansas at St. John the Evangelist Parish, and I have been a Capuchin since 1967. I'm bad at math, so hopefully you will uh, be able to do that. Um, today is the memorial of Saint uh, Pope John the Twenty Third, and it is an interesting thing that people thought that uh, he would, you know, serve his time, and he was older, and um, and then we could get on to business after his reign was over. But he surprised everyone because he was reading. Uh, the signs of the times and how the church was becoming more uh, perhaps uh, insular, you might say. And so what he wanted to do was call the Second Vatican Council together. And they have that famous saying to read the signs of the times and how we can be an instrument uh, for all the world to come to the Lord. And so, in many different ways. And the signs of the times is a very difficult concept because even in the time of Jesus, what was happening uh, in the readings today, they came and they wanted a sign uh, that Jesus was legitimate. And uh, he said there'd be no sign because they had signs. They had the best sign there possibly is, is Jesus himself. And he mentions Jonah, and that was as a sign that was given to people. So, signs of the times, I think we need to just really look and see what's going on, what kind of messages that are coming to us from the Lord, uh, through other people, through happenings in the world, Anything that um, we see that is good, that we can promote, so that uh, other people can come to the Lord and that we can really be an instrument uh, that people will follow the way of the Lord of concern for each other and all the different things that that means. And so we see signs uh, all the time. and. We just need to catch them. We need to catch them and to live them out. And so, happy sign hunting. They're all around us. Take care. Have a great day. We're praying for you. Please pray, pray for us. Take care. Bye now.